For today's beauty, we changed things up a bit and are joining Casey Wynn at La Bella Vida. And today he's going to be showing us the perfect look for going out, maybe with your significant other or even with your friends. So thank you for joining us this morning. Welcome. I'm really <laughs> excited to do a full face of makeup with you. Uh, let's talk a little bit about what we're going to be doing today. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to show you a quick, easy, smoky eye. I know that's the number one thing that people request is like a smoky eye. And everybody says they have a lot of problems with doing one. I want to show you some quick, easy tricks that will help you do it perfectly. Because yeah, I think for a lot of people, it's very difficult to get the perfect smoky eye without like, looking a little bit too dramatic or a little you splashy. You can go to that gothic side very easily. All right, well, let's get into it. So you want to use a base on the eyes. So I'm going to use a little bit of our color options. And I'm going to put it right on there as a base to hold that shadow on. And you just want to smooth that all over the eye. And then we're going to use a deeper color in the crease of the eye, a very deep, warm color. Just swipe back and forth and blend it right on that bone. Maybe just some little circles. You're going to want to take a kind of gray or taupe tone color, and you're going to take it and apply it all over the lid. A really soft kind of dome-shaped brush kind of fans out easily and smooths the color around. And then you take your highlight color across your brow bone and the corner of the eye. Just take it and gently sweep it across and blend the edges. And then we're going to take this black orchid eyeliner and line across the lash line and halfway underneath the eye. Using just small feathery strokes, fill in the lash line. And then look up, put your pencil on the side, and go halfway across the bottom. And then using your gray taupe color and smudger brush, pick up the color and blend it underneath the eye. And then using an angled brush, pick up your highlighter and smooth it underneath the eye from the corner to where it meets the liner. And then take your black liner again and line the inner rim or water line of the eye. Then we're gonna take a peachy tone blush and blend it on the apples of the cheeks and back. And then we're gonna use a nude or neutral tone gloss to just give it a hint of color. Well, this is such a beautiful look and you put it together so effortlessly. Do you think this is something that would take people a little bit of practice to really perfect? Just a little bit. I mean, the more that you kind of just play with your makeup and see what you can do, the more fun you'll have and the easier it'll get. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for showing us this look. I'm sure it is going to impress everyone that you see when you go out.